Mabuhay! Again, this is Elsie Kanoy and welcome to my video. For today's video, let's talk about the physical education in Renaissance. The Renaissance period, which came after the Dark Ages, lasted until the beginning of modern times. This was called the revival of learning, which also proved about the dignity of man and a renewed spirit of nationalism. This period also had its impact on physical education. The theory that the body and the soul were inseparable and individual became popular. It was the belief that a physical health promoted learning and that rest and recreation were needed by the body after study and work. Renaissance period helped to interpret the worth of physical education in the public. This was with belief that it was necessary for health as a means of developing the body, as a preparation for work phase, and a means of providing recreation for the wealthier classes of people. It however failed to recognize the importance of contribution of physical education to the aesthetic, social, and moral life in general. In this period, physical education was mostly a part of extracurriculum activities, which is fencing, bowling, tennis, and acrobatics. Although many sports were introduced during the Renaissance period, football, low bowling, and tennis were the three main sports, I mean three main sports that influenced today's period the most. During this period, the rise of the middle class or court, with the middle class being more involved, sports become popular as times of gathering with also the greatness of more free time. However, sports during this time were very dangerous. There were not set rules like there today. The main reason for this is some safety equipment was not accessible during these times of change. Sports during this time were just not well organized and there were no referees to keep control of the game. There were often certain days where sports brought the society together. They have they call the three days where they been together for the sports. Which is first it is a blow Monday, Shoes Tuesday, and a May Day. In these days, most of the society gathered in open spaces or loans where everyone could easily fit. Sports were a way where many people in society spent their free time together. 